Hello friends, today I will make short ribs. First I will make sauce. I'm gonna use uh, or you should use the beef broth but I don't have beef so I'm gonna use uh, chicken broth. You're supposed to use like one, uh, one, cup of, one cup of beef broth and one cup of uh, dry red wine but like I said, I don't have uh, beef, so I'm using this chicken uh, chicken broth with uh, white wine. So let's see how it will uh, how it will be. So I will put two cups here. So two cups of uh, chicken broth. Then I will I will put uh, oyster sauce uh, one third cup of oyster sauce i'm using this one but uh, you can use any like i have this one here it's just like i'm gonna try this one this one is uh, flavored so let's see how it will be okay I will use one, two, uh, you can use like uh, brown sugar, but I don't have brown sugar, so I'm using the white. I will use uh, five spices powder and I will use uh, one teaspoon, one teaspoon of these five spices. I don't know how how much I'm I'm making this first time, so we're gonna learn together. Okay. I will put one tablespoon of chopped garlic. So And I will mix this. I will put this on side. Actually, I will put this behind here. I have these uh, ribs. Those are uh, pork, boneless. And it's like 3.75 pounds. So let's see oh, but those are big so i will use i will cut it in half and uh, i will have two of them and uh, basically I will just use the butt wrap. I will put on each side. Like I said, this is my first time, so uh, we will see how how it will be. Maybe I should cut this here, but I left it, so we will see how it will go. Don't forget to wash hands every time you're touching the meat. Okay, I will put on. Uh, Sate. Sate on high for 30 minutes and I press start. Let me just spray a little bit of avocado oil. So I will do each side roughly like two, maybe three minutes max. So I'll be right back. A little bit of cayenne pepper. And I put uh, five whole cloves. And 
and uh, three dangerous animals into this, and then uh, I will put small piece of uh, cinnamon quills. Okay, so let me take the meat out. And I, I will put a little bit of sauce on the bottom. And I will deglaze this. So I think it's done. It's nice, good. Okay, and uh, now I will put these onions. Here. Four. Then I put those spices in the middle. Okay. I will put the ribs. On top of the onion okay and now I take the sauce and pour on top of the ribs I will close this okay make sure this is close I will use pressure cook on high for for 45 minutes and then I will uh, do natural release for uh, 15 minutes and then uh, quick release okay you have to be fast so okay pressure cook on high for and then press start okay so pressure will build and uh, I will be back I will be back in like uh, this uh, pressure will build probably like 10-15 minutes then uh, 45 so an hour roughly okay it took uh, roughly 8 10 minutes to pressure build so now it will uh, pressure cook for uh, 45 minutes I uh, I will make satay and uh, I will add quarter cup of uh, cornstarch and quarter cup of uh, water and mix it and uh, you can add quarter cup of uh, honey but uh, I don't have it so I will do it without I would like to ask you uh, if you like this video I hope you like it please smash that like button and subscribe share with family and friends and anybody you know it will help to grow my channel and I will really appreciate that okay same okay thanks I will be back in 39 minutes or so okay I did uh natural release for uh, 15 minutes and now I will uh, I will do quick release okay pin just dropped so it wasn't too much 
pressure left so let me open this be careful this is hot I burned myself last time so don't touch this and this one is hot too but this is more okay point away from you okay and with this instant pot I can put this on side and uh, have it there let's put the ribs on plate let's take this out I will hit cancel, I will turn it off and I put saute and start. So when that uh, start bubble I will add uh, this which I have uh, a uh, quarter cup of cornstarch and quarter cup of water so it will basically uh, make sauce a little bit thicker I will slurry and stir and that will make the sauce thicker Okay, I will turn it off and uh, I put a little bit of uh, sauce okay so looks nice let me try this Oh, it's tender, it's juicy. Oh, let me try. Mm -hmm. So juicy, so tender, the best ribs you will eat, I guarantee you. So, do this recipe the way I did and you will enjoy it. It's so, so good. Delicious. Look. Look at this. Food is so good. And, uh, you know, when you try this recipe, I am sure you will like it. Because it's really, really good. Yummy. Okay? Like always, I will, I will ask you, please smash that like button and subscribe. Share with family, friends and anybody. So you're going to help me grow my channel. So thank you again for watching and I will see you in next one. Ciao.